We all like free shit and I've got some free shit for you as well and it's not the one I just dumped down the toilet while doing research for this video. Oh no 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 not that, that's just gross, we're getting some cool free stuff coming to PlayStation VR but first of all... This is the US code for Homestar VR, a application where you look at the stars. Whoever won, congratulations, install it and look at the stars and think about the meaning and the message. Very nice stars in this game, very nice representation of the night without the light pollution and just beautiful stars glowing in your face. Let's do the news! And we're gonna talk about two free games, one free demo, free DLC and that will be all for free but also we're gonna talk about PSVR update for PS4 game but this one I'm not sure if it's free. It might be. But it might be not, not sure. Like I said, anyway, let's talk about some free stuff. Vroom, kaboom! I spoke about it in past, yes, but I'm gonna do some spoking again because this got a bit delayed. But now developers said this will be releasing within a month. And this is a Tower Rouge game sparkled with some pretty cool vibe of Twisted Metal and some cult collection and as well all the vehicle lovers. If you love your vehicle, you will love this game because you can take control of them and like kind of ride them. So you collect in your cards, building your awesome team of vehicles and sending them off to a battle to fight the other player. Because this game also having a multiplayer mode for all of you who likes to play online which is very nice fact because the game will be free which means everyone will download it probably and we all can play online it's free so just download it and check it out it's a free to play game so of course you'll be able to buy premium content if you want that's how free to play works you probably don't have to if you want to do some grinding but you can buy it if you don't want to do some grinding it's free and it looks great and it's gonna support psvr so let's be happy about it but another one the game i've been banging on about because i just like banging especially when it's a good banging and this one looks like a good bang because it's a honor and duty and it's getting open beta very very soon we'll be able to download it and we all can play online as well so the game is already in Sony's quality assurance, they work in some stuff with Sony, working together to make sure you get smooth experience. You know, Sony's quality assurance, they do a few steps in a game and they go Bleh! We feeling sick, you have to hide blinders as well. But of course, developers sometimes choosing to give us an option and they definitely will give us an option. So don't worry about that, this game got everything. It's got multiple control support, you can use any controller you want at any time or you can use them together. It's got vehicles like tanks when you can ride with a team of your buddies, so it's like bridge crew but faster, better and harder. But also you can drive other vehicles like cars, jeeps, trucks, whatever you find you just gonna ride it because you just like to sit on things and make noises. But apart from that this game might support 64 players which is even awesomer and the latest what they told me what they add in is destructible environment so it won't be just like a fucking not non-destructible it's you'll be able to destruct something so this game looks awesome it's online it's like battlefield in vr but better because it's not made by ea but anyway let's speak about this free demo now what's the demo is coming contagion vr outbreak a game which all of you got boner about it's coming to psvr very very soon the developers say within a month I already spoke about it and I'm speaking it again just to do compiling of all the free shit we get in I compiled the shit and just picked it all out from this what's free like picking a sweet corn from a sheet you might eat it and it's, it just comes out the same it's not getting digest the sweet corn the magic of sweet corn Whatever, I don't know what I'm talking about, but Contagion looks great, full game will be out probably like within a year, but the demo will be out within a month or two or so. The full game will have like 8 hours campaign and also multiplayer modes as well, so this game just is sweet. Now, free DLC, as you noticed lately we've had Ark Park Pteros Owl Hill DLC, which gave us some maps, but then you look at PC version of this DLC and there's some shit missing from PSVR, but they will release another DLC when the missing shit will appear. So on PC they've got that balloon ride, but on PSVR we don't, and for all of you balloon lovers who likes to just be in balloons, they're gonna release it and you'll be able to play with it and fly around it and see uh, dinosaurs. It's gonna come with the next update and next update might be dinosaur racing. They've done a poll and I think dinosaur racing one 
so at least they bring in fun to a game. Now let's speak about the PSVR update for PS4 game. I've done review of the station while ago and I said that they will be bringing VR update and it's still happening. We're getting closer and closer to release date, should drop very soon. Station is a great game, I really liked it, especially for a very cheap price it sells for. But the DLC, I don't know if it's gonna be DLC for free, is it gonna be free patch or is it gonna be separate game what you're gonna have to pay, but whatever it will be, the station will be worth picking up anyway. I enjoy it. It's like a space exploration with some puzzles and unlocking doors and like a mystery you finding out what's happened. It looks pretty cool so a lot of free stuff coming. It's awesome and that's it. Bye!